It's the most wonderful time of the year. Today I am back with over 100 Christmas gift ideas for teen girls. If you're a teen girl and you're watching this, I really hope this can give you some inspiration. And if you're a mom or a sibling or a dad shopping for your teen daughter, welcome, I'm so glad you're here. If you guys like any of the gift ideas I mentioned, I will actually have everything linked down below in the description box. All you have to do is just scroll down, find the gift you want and click the link and it'll take you directly to the product where you can buy it. Also disclaimer, I just wanna say, I know Christmas is not about the gifts. I'm Christian, so I'm so excited to celebrate Jesus and celebrate everything God has done for us. The first First category is the top 10 gifts of 2023. Starting off strong with the heatless hair curler. This was the number one gift of last year. I love this gift because it's super affordable and it fits for basically any girl. Girls who are super low maintenance will love that you just have to put it in your hair and then sleep with it and wake up with good hair, good curls. And girls who love beauty and stuff will also love it because again, it's such a great hair product. I actually really wanna get one of these because so many of you guys got these last year and absolutely love them. So I'll have that link down below. The next idea is a makeup organizer. You can also use this for skincare. I will link a couple ones down below. There's like the acrylic ones that are super, super cute. Or there's like those little ones where it's almost like a little cabinet and you can have all your stuff in there. It just makes doing your makeup and your skincare so much more fun. And these were another top seller last year. The next idea are platform Converse. I have two pairs of platform Converse. One is pink and one is black and I'm obsessed. I basically wear like no other shoe. You can also just get regular Converse. I just like the platform because I think it looks really cute. Next up are LED lights. I have LED lights in my room and it completely changes the entire atmosphere of your room at night. It is so fun to change the colors. They're super easy to install as well and they're surprisingly affordable. The next idea is a Bible. I started reading the Bible a couple years ago and it completely changed my life. Mine is from Hosanna Revival. The next idea are over ear headphones. There's two different kinds that are trendy. There's the Bose ones and there's the Apple ones. So I will link both of those down below. I think they're around the same price. The Apple ones might be more expensive but I know that they're really good quality and they're definitely going to last you a long time. And if you already have the Apple headphones you can actually get cute little things to customize them and I think that's the cutest thing. Next up we have cloud slides. These slides have been popular for quite a while now but I think everyone loves them. I have a pair of slides similar and my sister has these exact cloud slides and she loves them. They're like comfortable but you can still like leave the house in them. The next gift idea is very expensive but I will be sharing a dupe with you guys. The Dyson Air Wrap. I do not have a Dyson Air Wrap but my friend has one and she absolutely loves it. She got it for Christmas last year. It doubles as a straightening iron, a blow dryer, a curling iron, literally everything and it costs causes no heat damage. And I have two dupes for you guys. I have the Shark Flex Style. I got it a couple months ago. It is the best thing ever. Okay, don't judge my hair. I was rushing this morning, so I couldn't really get it to be like perfect, but it definitely improved my hair so much. I have way less heat damage and it's like half the price of the Dyson. And if you guys are looking for an even cheaper dupe, there is the Revlon Blow Dryer Brush. I had this for about a year and it was really helpful for getting my hair super straight. The only thing is you definitely wanna make sure that you use heat protectant with this. So I will have heat protectant linked down below. The next gift idea are Ugg. The Ugg Minis, the Ugg Ultra Minis, and this slipper by Ugg, I completely forgot what it's called, are so popular this year. Yes, they're expensive, but I will share a dupe with you guys in a second. However, if you have the money to spend on it, I definitely recommend Uggs because I had a pair of Uggs one time and they lasted me like years and years and years. They're so well made, especially if you live in a cold area, you're definitely gonna use them. So I'll have those linked down below. And I'll also have linked down below these dupes. These are the best dupes on the market. I sound like a real estate agent. On the market. <laughs> the next idea is a plan. Planner. Since it is almost 2024, which is so weird, you could definitely get a planner for the new year and start off on a good track. The next idea is a suitcase. I think most people kind of forget about their suitcase until it comes time to travel. And then you're like, wow, my suitcase is like really old and like kind of broken. Like mine's broken. And some suitcases are actually more affordable than you would think. And it's something you would definitely use. The next idea is a macrame plant hanger. These are so cute. I actually have one like in my kitchen. You can just hang them like anywhere in your room. And it's just super cute because a little plant can just like hang out in there. It's like a plant hammock. Like that is the best thing ever. Next up we have the Honest Beauty Lip Balm. I love these. I have two of them and they are absolutely amazing. I'm wearing it right now. They're super affordable and they're clean and they actually look so cute. Like it looks like a little lipstick or something but it's actually just a tinted lip balm. The next category is beauty. Starting off strong with a gua sha. Gua sha's are super affordable and honestly I think they need to be a part of everyone's skincare routine. There's so many benefits and it's so great for your skin. It can also give you a jawline. I mean I'm not a great example but it just helps like define your face and it can be good with like blood circulation and it also can prevent wrinkles. The next idea is a face roller. You can actually put these in the fridge and then in the morning you can roll your face with it and it kind of helps depuff your face. Again, these are super affordable and they're so cute. This is also a great stocking stuffer. The next idea is a body scrub. This is something that I think everyone would use. It's just so much fun for like a spa day and you can even get like a Christmas one. I will have some linked down below. Next up, we have a beauty blender. It's so important to switch out your beauty blender on a regular basis and they're super affordable too. The next idea is a bath bomb. You really just can't go wrong with a bath bomb. Like it's so much fun. Then we 
have a face mask. There are a bunch of different affordable sheet masks out there. My personal favorite though is the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. It has like all clean ingredients, which is super important to me. And it just makes my skin so soft. The big size is like very expensive, but there's actually a mini and it's a lot more affordable. And that's actually the one I have and it has lasted me a year. The next idea are PJs. You can't go wrong with PJs. Like everyone needs pajamas. And I think Christmas is the perfect time to get a new pair of pajamas because then you'll have them for the new year. Next up are no crease hair clips. Basically you can take these and like put your hair back with them when you're doing your makeup or when you're doing your skincare. These were another top seller last year and I have them myself and I find them super useful for when you've already done your hair and you want to do your makeup or your skincare. They're super affordable and like celebrities use them. Definitely a great gift and a great stocking stuffer. Then we have a hair mask. I got this hair mask from Shea Moisture. It's super affordable. It did wonders for my hair. Like my hair is so soft because of it. I had such bad heat damage because I was not using a heat protectant for years. It has made my hair so much silkier, so much healthier. Next up are under eye patches. These are so fun for spa days and they can help you glow up and deep puff. And next up is an ice roller. So many people have these. You can just throw them in the fridge and then it's great to just like deep puff your face in the morning. Next up is a makeup bag. I accidentally bought the Glossier makeup bag one time. Don't ask. And it has been one of the best things like I've ever purchased. I will link the Glossier one down below as well as a bunch of other cute ones. Plus makeup bags can sometimes just get like really messy because you have like makeup in there. So I think switching it out and getting a new one would be a great idea. The next idea is a light up makeup mirror. I have one of these and I think it is so useful, especially if there's one with like a magnifying side and they're not as expensive as you would think yet they still look like a really big and exciting gift. Next up is a spa headband. I have a full on collection of these. I think I have like five. I've been collecting them for years though. I use them literally constantly. Like every time I do my skincare, all the time when I'm doing my makeup, sometimes I'll just like wear it because it's comfortable. Next up is a hair dryer. Then we have Glossier makeup and Glossier skincare. I have used a lot of Glossier makeup and I love their makeup. I will link some of my favorite products down below. Sounds like the Grinch is on the loose. <laughs> I'm I am a Christmas nerd, okay? It's October and I already have all of this set up. The next idea are claw clips. Next up we have candles. I last year found the cutest candle company on Amazon and they have little Christmas ones. They have little encouraging quotes. I think it's called Sweetwater. I don't know, but I will link it down below. I just think these are so cute and so fun. The next option is a diffuser. Diffusers are amazing because it just makes your whole room smell like whatever like essential oil you put in there. The next idea are makeup brushes. Again, even if you already have makeup brushes, it's good to switch them out every once in a while to keep them fresh. There's actually a full set of makeup brushes by the brand e.l.f. or elf i just like saying elf because it's like christmas vibes and it's actually like so affordable i think they have one for like 12 dollars and then another one for 15. the next gift idea is body lotion there are so many different cute christmas ones out there so i'll have those linked down below again this is something that you know the person will use then we have slippers there are the cute smiley slippers that a lot of people have those were another one of the top sellers last year and they're still trendy and still just as adorable this year but i will have a couple other ones linked down below the next idea is a makeup palette i really want to try out the one from Honest Beauty because that is a clean makeup brand and it's also very affordable. Next up we have a cozy robe. You can't go wrong with cozy robe. Like who's gonna say no to a cozy robe? I love just classic fuzzy robes as well as like the waffly one that kind of gives you like hotel spa vibes. Next up is a hairbrush. I totally recommend the brand Wet Brush and they actually have a couple eco-friendly ones and even mini ones that you can throw in a stocking. Then we have a curling iron, a hair straightener, and a mermaid hair waver. I really want to get one of these. Basically you just like crimp your hair with it and it gives you like these really pretty beach waves. It's great for someone like me because you like cannot go wrong. You just have to like clamp it and then your hair comes out with these like beautiful mermaid curls. Then we have a skincare fridge. These are so cute and so useful, especially if you have like an ice roller. You can even keep some products in there, which is really nice because you can have like your skincare nice and cold. Next up we have perfume. I have the best perfume recommendation for you guys. I like perfume on other people, but on myself, I'm super picky about it. And my favorite perfume of all time is the Glossier perfume. The cool thing about it is that it actually like changes depending on who it's on so it smells different on everybody it just smells so good it's like clean but it still smells like warm this is coming from a person who is super picky with their scents and i absolutely love this one next up is nail polish nail art stickers and last but not least we have press on nails i usually don't have anything on my nails however i love press on nails i got these ones from the brand kiss one time they were so fun and i wore them for a trip and they lasted me like a week or two along with that there are magnetic press on nails by the brands glamnetic and static nails i think these are so 
cool because you can reuse them a bunch of times and they have like the most beautiful colors. I actually really want to try these and so I will link some of my favorites down below for you guys. The next category is room decor. Starting off strong with a satin pillowcase. I have been using a satin pillowcase for like two years now and it is the best thing ever. I think this is the perfect gift for teen girls because it actually helps with acne and it keeps your hair frizz down. This is mine. It's a really pretty floral one and it is by the brand Kitsch. I have multiple from this brand. This is something that was actually a top seller last year and you really can't go wrong with it so I 10 out of 10 recommend. And if you have the money to spend, I definitely recommend a silk pillowcase. Silk is so healthy for you and again, it's great for your skin and your hair. Then we have a fuzzy blanket. You can't go wrong with a fuzzy blanket. I've heard that the Barefoot Dreams ones are so soft and so amazing but I'll have some more affordable ones linked down below as well. Then we have throw pillows. Next up we have a projector. I think projectors are so cool because you can like watch a movie in your room or you can even like play video games. Next up we have a wall collage. I will have a bunch of different ones linked down below. These are super affordable and honestly my room before the wall collage was like sad. It was blank. It was not as cute as it is now and now that I have the wall collage I'm just like excited every single time I enter my room. It changed my entire room and it actually made it look so much bigger. Then we have a hanging chair. If I had space in my room for a hanging chair I would have one. There are the like acrylic ones that are really really cool or there's the more affordable macrame ones which are again so cute and so cozy. Next up we have vines. Personally I already have like every inch of my wall is covered so I can't have vines in my room but I think they are so cute and they're really affordable. There's even some that have fairy lights mixed in. That is so pretty. That sounds like literally like a magical fairy garden. Then we have string lights. You can't go wrong with string lights. I have some string lights on my bed right now. Next up are plants or if you're like me and you cannot handle a plant you can get fake plants. Then we have a bean bag. My friend of mine has one and she always uses it when she's reading. They're so comfy to just like cannonball in. Next up is a lap desk. I don't know if you guys know this but it's actually really unhealthy to have a laptop straight on your lap. So having a lap desk to put your laptop on top of is so helpful. Even if you don't even use a laptop this is great for like if you want to read on the couch or if you want to write. Next up we have a bed canopy. I think these are so so pretty. I had one when I was younger and it is like the best thing ever. Like you just feel like a princess. Then we have an alarm clock. There's this really expensive one called I think Hatch. It is so cool. It basically like mimics the sun so it's really healthy for your body. One day I really want to own one but I also have some more affordable options linked down below. Next up we have an LED wall sign. You can get these actually customized which I think is the coolest thing. Imagine if you got one that like said your name and you just like had it like over your bed. That'd be so cute. Then we have new bedding. Bedding makes a world of a difference in your room. I've had my bedding for about two, three years now. My aunt got it for me. She's amazing. Love you so much. It's a super simple white duvet cover so I have not gotten tired of it at all. I think simple white bedding could just like change your room completely. Along with that we have new sheets. You could also get satin sheets which is so luxurious. Like what? And they're actually not that expensive. Next up you can get a little rolling cart. These can be used as like a bedside table or you can keep like books in it or even art supplies or makeup. And last but not least for the room decor category, we have a full length mirror. I got a full length mirror a couple years ago for Christmas and it was one of the best things ever. If mine is still being sold, I will have it linked down below. This is something that will also be used for years. The next category is clothing. I love clothing shopping. So you guys are in luck. I will link everything I find down below. Starting off strong with a puffer coat. Puffer coats have been trendy for the past couple years and spoiler alert, I'm actually asking for one this year. There are so many different cute options out there. I would recommend getting black or brown. I feel like those colors are really simple, but they can just match with a lot of outfits. Next up, we have earmuffs. Earmuffs are actually so cute and so stylish. Next up, we have fuzzy socks. You can't go wrong with fuzzy socks. Like everyone loves fuzzy socks. Next up, our new tennis shoes slash running shoes. I am in desperate need of a new pair of running shoes. I love the brand Hakka. I think those are so, so cute. Next up, our sweatshirts. Again, you can't go wrong with sweatshirts. Next up, we have sweatpants slash sweat shorts. These kind of like cargo sweats are really trendy right now. So I will have these linked down below on Amazon. Next up is a beanie. I think beanies are so cute. The next gift is a tote bag. There are a couple different tote bags that are trendy right now. First up is the long champ bag. I think they're really good quality and they're really cute and you can use them for school. You can also just get like a plain one. I have one that's just like canvas and it matches with every outfit. Next up we have a shoulder bag. I have a black one and it is like the most useful thing ever. As a teen, I don't really like carry that much around. Usually just like basically my phone. So having that to hold it in is both aesthetic and super helpful. Next up we have jewelry. There are these packs on Amazon of gold dipped earring sets and it comes with like a bunch of them and it's so affordable. So I will have those linked down below. The next gift idea are new jeans. Everyone needs a new pair of jeans, especially for the new year going back to school. Next up, we have blue light glasses. If you spend a lot of time on a screen, I definitely recommend these because they can protect your eyes. Then we have headbands. I wear headbands like literally every single day. I just find it so easy to get up in the morning and just put on a headband. Oh my goodness, there are two raccoons on my fence. Oh my goodness, there's a third, there's a third. It's literally the middle of the day. I'm so confused. <laughs> There's a fourth. Oh my goodness, Mimi. 
The next idea is a hair bow. I think these are so cute, especially in winter for some reason. I don't know. I just think like a sweater and a hair bow is like so adorable. Next up is like a good everyday jacket. Something that's just like a great thing to just grab and it like matches with every outfit. Then we have Doc Martens. I think Doc Martens are so cute. You can get like the classic boot. You can get the platform boot. I have a Doc Martin dupe and they are the platform ones from I believe Steve Madden. They are amazing. I love wearing them in fall and winter. Yep, there goes number seven. Oh my, there's another one. This is a whole family. Next up is a new backpack. You can get a Kankin backpack. I've had one for years and it has lasted me so long. You can put a computer in there. You can actually fit way more than you would expect. But there's also the North Face bags and I think they are so cute. I love the light pink. I believe there's a light blue as well, but also the black is super durable. Now we have a little like mini category within the clothing category, which is athletic wear. Starting off with workout tops. There are these really cool ones on Amazon that have like a built-in bra and everything. Then we have workout bottoms. So this is like shorts, leggings, workout skirts, or you can even get a workout set so everything matches already. This is perfect for the new year and starting new habits. Next up we have gloves. Then we have sunglasses and finishing off the clothing category with Vans. A friend of mine has like a full Vans collection and she always looks so cute and she wears them all the time. They're super comfortable for school. The next category is the electronics category. While this sounds like it'd be a super expensive category, it's actually not. I have a bunch of different ideas. Starting off expensive with a new phone. I think the iPhone 15 just came out. That would be such an exciting and amazing gift. I'll have it linked down below. I have the iPhone 13 that I got last year. No, 14. I have the iPhone 14 that I got last year and it is actually such great quality. Next up we have AirPods or even just like earphones that you plug in. I honestly prefer those because I'm not the biggest Bluetooth fan. Next up we have a new phone case. A lot of people's phone cases can get just really messed up from either like dropping your phone, holding it all the time, and it just kind of getting like thrown around everywhere. So I'll have a bunch of cute ones down below. Some of my favorites are from Casetify. I have never tried this brand, but I just think they are so, so cute. They have ones that you can actually customize with your name on it, and they're supposed to have like the best protection, so you can drop your phone and nothing will happen. The brand I have is called Otterbox. I hate to admit it, but I am like literally so clumsy, and so I drop my phone quite often. There's not a single scratch on my phone. It's in perfect condition. My whole family has this brand, and we absolutely love it. Next up, we have a speaker. Another idea that I think is so cool is a shower speaker. Basically, you connect it to your phone, and then you can just have your phone like in the other room or wherever, and you can literally play music in your shower. Like that is the coolest thing. Next idea is a beaded phone chain. You can just have it like around your wrist while you're carrying your phone. That way, if you drop it, it's like still connected to you. And either way, they're just like really cute and aesthetic. Next up is a Polaroid camera. I have a pink Polaroid camera. I've taken a bunch of Polaroids with it, and it's just so special to have those. You can get an Insta Mini, which is what I have, which comes out like a little mini Polaroid, or there's just like a regular Polaroid. However, there is something that I think is even cooler, which is a Polaroid printer. With a Polaroid printer, you can take any picture that you have on your phone and just print it into a Polaroid. Literally, that is the coolest thing. I think this is amazing because sometimes like I forget to like bring my Polaroid places or sometimes you're out of film in the moment. So it's cool to have this so you can come back and like print a picture at any time. I feel like if I were to ask again, I would definitely ask for the Polaroid printer just because I think it's so cool. But both are amazing options. And if you have a Polaroid, you can ask for Polaroid film. I always run out of Polaroid film so fast. So I'm really hoping I get this this year. Hint, hint. Then we have a Polaroid album. I think this is so, so cute. You can have all your little Polaroid in there. Next up is a disposable camera. These are super affordable and they're so fun. I have a disposable camera from like literally two years ago. I have not gotten it developed still. And an even cooler thing is an underwater disposable camera. I had one of these and I think it is the coolest thing, especially if you're going to go like on a spring break trip. You could take pictures like in the pool or underwater at the ocean. Then we have a film camera. It's just so cool to have like actual film. The next gift idea is to get a digital camera. These are actually going like viral on TikTok right now. Everyone is taking their Instagram pictures with these. I think people on TikTok like it because it's supposed to like smooth your skin out and just like make everyone look good. They're definitely an investment, but they are so worth it. I actually have the Canon G7X, which I'm filming on right now. You can take such amazing, beautiful photos on it. You can zoom, you can do all this stuff. Even if you're not like a YouTuber, it's just great to have a camera because you can film both videos and take pictures. It's really compact, so you can just like throw it in your purse. I 10 out of 10 recommend this. I will link the most affordable option down below. Next up, we have a MacBook or a laptop. I have had a MacBook for the past, I wanna say three or four years years and it has held up so well. I use it literally on a daily basis, doing schoolwork, doing YouTube videos, going on Pinterest, literally everything. However, you don't need a MacBook. There are amazing laptops out there that are like half the price. I will link some down below. Then we have a laptop sleeve. Next up, we have a record player. And if you already have a record player, you can get some records. Then we have an iPad. I have an iPad. I use it for making thumbnails. I use it for digital drawing and mine is pink. So it's like extra adorable. You can also get an Apple pencil, which I completely recommend. It's super fun to just like use it to draw or even just use using it to like search and stuff. It makes it super easy. You can also get an iPad mini, which is a lot cheaper. Next gift is an attachable keyboard for your iPad. So basically it makes your iPad turn into a laptop with just like this attachable
portable keyboard. I think Apple has some, but there's also some dupes on Amazon. I think this is so cool if you already have an iPad and you kind of want a computer, but you don't know if you need both because then you can use your iPad like a computer. The next gift is a Nintendo Switch. I have a Nintendo Switch and I literally love it so much. There's also a Nintendo Switch Lite, which is like a little mini version. If you already have a Switch, you can also get some games. My favorite games are Animal Crossing. I think it is such a cute, wholesome game as well as Mario Kart. Not to brag, but I'm actually like pretty decent at it. The next category is the miscellaneous category. Starting off strong with a journal. You can just get like a blank journal where you can write your life or you can get a guided journal. I found this super cute one on Amazon and it's called the Psalmful Journal. Oh my goodness, it is so precious. It makes it so easy because you don't have to think about like, oh, what am I gonna write? Because it already has prompts and this one also just like looks so aesthetic. Next up are Papermate pens. I use them for like everything. For like literally writing anything, I always use like a Papermate pen. They are like felt tip and so it's kind of almost like a marker but they don't really smudge and I just think they're really great quality. Next up we have Mild Liner Highlighters. I love Mild Liner Highlighters. You can take notes with them. You can do Bible studies with them. You can even like just draw and do art with them. Then we have scrunchies. You can't go wrong with scrunchies. No matter their hair type or hair length, I think so many girls will use scrunchies just because it's easy to like put your hair back with it and it doesn't damage your hair. Next up is a workout mat. Having a cute workout mat just like motivates you to actually like work out. I love the one from Aloe. I think it's just so, so cute, so aesthetic, but it is very expensive. So I'll have some cheaper ones down below. Then we have a wallet. It's actually just so great to have a wallet even if you don't really like use cash that much because you just have like a place to like put everything. Next up are weights. I think these weights are so cute. They're from the Vlog Lottie's brand. They're just so chic. Like they're so girly. I just love it. Next up we have a tie-dye kit and you can also get like white sweatshirts and white sweatpants so you can tie-dye things yourself. Next up are roller skates. This is so random but I just think they're so fun. The next gift is a skateboard or a penny board. Penny boards are cheaper and easier to use but if you're more experienced you can get a skateboard. Next up is a helmet because as my mom says you have to protect your little melon. <laughs> next up are reusable straws. I really soon want to get some glass straws. I think glass straws are better than metal straws because you can like see through them so you can make sure they're clean. The next idea is merch from your favorite celebrity or your favorite YouTuber. The next gift idea is books. And if you're shopping for a bookworm and you don't know what book to get them, if they have a Goodreads, you can actually just go on there and see like what they've been saving recently. And that would be really cool because you get to surprise them and you know they'd actually like the book. And the next idea is to get a gift card. Last but not least, if you don't have anything you want to ask for, you could just donate to charity. Helping other people is just so much more fulfilling than getting a gift. There's so many amazing charities out there, but one of my favorites is called Compassion. You can actually sponsor a child through there, which is so cool because you'll get to pay for their education, for their food, for their healthcare, or even Bibles. And I just think it's such an amazing special charity. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it to this point, make sure to comment this emoji. Don't forget to shop everything down below in the description box. Keep smiling and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.